A very welcome to you. We are here with 4th of July's Godly Blessing. If you are full of all attainments from God, automatically it shows it on our face. And the sparkle on our face and the eyes. It shows that we are complete. We don't need anything from this world. And we are completely spiritually happy and contented. And that's what God is trying to tell us over here. With his own words, he says, May you be full of all attainments. That is purity, power, happiness, love, peace, knowledge and bliss. These are the seven main chakras and these are the attainments which we get from God in entirety. So God says, And let that sparkle and intoxication of your complete stage be seen on your face. So at the confluence age, when God comes down and he meets us children who have got tired taking the complete cycle of life, the complete circle we have finished by taking many births and we are in the last birth and we are physically and mentally tired at that the time God comes and he empowers us, removes the waste thoughts, gives us the guidance of removing them, gives us the method of connecting with him so that his light, his power, his purity, his knowledge enters us and we are able to overcome the weaknesses which we have entailed over a period of time. So at the confluence age, the speciality of Brahmin life is to swing in swing of happiness. Happiness, peace, joy, knowledge and bliss and to be stable in the imperishable intoxication of the full form of all attainments. So we start with power, then purity, then happiness or contentment and then we have love, then we have peace, then we have knowledge and then we have bliss. On your face, let the sparkle and intoxication of the full stage of attainment and nothing but attainment be seen. Just as the kings who were complete, if you remember the kingship or the kingdoms, you saw the kings who were complete with all the wealth, had that sparkle of physical wealth on their faces and they had so much of sparkle, they had so much of robe and they had so much of pride actually because they had so much of wealth. So here you have imperishable attainment. Therefore, let the spiritual sparkle and intoxication of such attainment be seen on your face. Even if you don't have physical good wealth, even if you don't have financial good wealth, but the spiritual sparkle is different because financial and physical is physical in terms and spiritual means the soul. The soul inside can be happy no matter what. The soul inside can be content no matter what. The soul inside can be pure and can be completely humble and genuine and kind and powerful no matter what the outer situations are. And that's what God says, be in connection with me. Learn that method of Raj Yoga connection. Learn that method of soul to supreme soul, Atma, Paramatma connection. And then you'll be automatically be in the state where your face will show the sparkle and, and also show the happiness and all that means. And that's what the world is looking for because everybody else you see in the world, their faces are morose, their faces are sad, they're full of all worries, what's going to happen because they don't know the answers to them. And Brahma Kumaris is giving you all the answers with the help of Godfather. Om Shanti.